How's everybody doing? We're playing UFO Robot Grindis or the Feast of Wolves. This came out like I think it was like three weeks ago from the time I'm recording this one, but this looked like an interesting game, and I want to give it a shot because it looks like it's got many different play styles. It's a classic, ro like super robot action. What options have we got? Camera shake 100 percent. And we'll see how it works. I mean, it could be too much shake. The fall of Fleed? Fled? Up there, far away in space, is the planet Fleed. Fleed. I thought it's a technologically advanced planet whose people have overcome the hardships of life to live in peace and harmony with nature. I thought it turned subtitles on cutscenes. On this day, blessed by the stars, Fleed is to celebrate the union of its prince, Duke Fleed, with Rubina, the heiress of the mighty Vega Empire. But in reality, oh. the Vega care little for Fleed's royal family. Led by Blackie, the most merciless of their officers, they strike, taking advantage of the wedding to plunder the planet's resources. Led by who? Only one Fleedian, Duke Fleed, still stands against them. In the shadows of an ancient sanctuary, he is about to awaken the guardian of Fleed, a machine called Grandizer. Grandizer, I was close. Not familiar with the source material. What are you thinking? We've no choice. But Grandizer hasn't been buried all these years without good reason. Well, it's high time to wake it up then. The Vegas treachery cannot go unpunished. Grandizer, go! Yes! I do want to check that. Options. Oh, so the cutscenes was off. My bad. Where oh. are you, my prince? I believe I'm in the heart of this sanctuary. Make haste, your highness. War is nearly upon us. I'm moving as fast as I can right now. Blast! My way is blocked by rocks. Have you forgotten Grendizer's legendary fists? Nothing can stand against them. Legend is true. Legend is true. His fists are legendary. Oh damn! They're doing a number. How will Fleet ever recover from such destruction? Praise the stars! There you are, your highness. Just look at what the Vega have done to our planet. Come, my prince. Oh. All is not yet lost. The young man I taught would never have awakened Grendizer in vain. What do you intend to do, your highness? Save the planet. Fleed is counting on its guardian. We must repel the invaders and lead our people to safety. With all due respect, my prince, your family is also counting on you. Maria and your parents were waiting for you at the palace to celebrate the wedding. I can't imagine their distress. Yeah, screw the populace. The princess is tougher than she looks, and my parents didn't raise me to be a coward. Also, everyone there can rely on our Praetorians. Our fellow citizens won't be so lucky. Your concern does you credit, your highness. Your parents would be proud of you. Except for the fact you made it sound like that's what we weren't supposed to do. Come on, we haven't got a minute to lose. To protect Fleed, you must absorb its rays of light. They are what will restore Grandizer to its full potential. Okay, how do we do that? Grandizer uses sun energy regenerate. I, I was going to say rays of light. You mean the sun? So up to regenerate. Take a special bar, I'm assuming. Good as new. Okay. okay. Now we can jump. The door that once guarded the entrance to the sanctuary. Fist won't be enough this time. Uh oh. The legendary double harken, on the other hand. Ooh, legendary double harken. Oh wow, we can charge it a few times. Okay. One, two, three. It has been a long time since anybody has visited this place. That's cool. This level of the charging. Despite all its power, Grandizer is not invincible. Avoid the blows from that machine. Oh, we got dodge rolls. 
In that case, let's see what Vega's robots are made of. Gun. Now do you Not much. Why the Vega are planning to steal this machine? It was that their plan? There's the old boat. Use your dyser punch to grab what's left oh. on the bridge. Okay, then so we gotta go there. Use a dyser punch. R two? Is it just R two? Oh, just you just hit tap it. So here's the pack of rabid wolves attacking a peaceful planet. But who do they answer to? I cannot say exactly, my prince. I could only intercept one message from all the Vega communications, and it's confusing to say the least. Hey, weren't you going to marry the princess? Don't you know who's in charge? To all units, this is Colonel Blackie. His Excellency King Vega orders us to destroy this planet. Uh, what's confusing about this? We must make them see that our people are the strongest, that the armies of Vega are invincible. Fleed must submit immediately. But the sycophants of the Royal Guard are not worthy of this honor, let alone a bureaucrat like the superintendent. I'm counting on all of you. Show them what we can do. This world is ours. No, this world is yours by right. Eliminate all resistance. If the Vega expect resistance, let's not disappoint them. Hell yeah. I'm with you, your highness. But please be careful. All right, do we go to zones? Like, how's this work? Oh, there's a mission right there, I'm assuming. Oh, but there's a train right there. So this is like the overworld. Okay, cool. We just fight random things on the screen? Can I... But it's the wrong way, but can I blow up these houses? There might be stuff in them. My prince, the Baron of Leeds' estate is in danger. We'll need those rockets for the evacuation. We okay, does the punch defend. actually do damage? Oh god, it... <laughs> I mean, it does damage, it's not in the way I intended. Beware, my prince. Here they come. Punch! Oh, the combat feels really good. Oh no. My instruments are flooded with Vega transmissions. Oh no. Cease your searching at once. Some kind soul has led Grendizer straight to us. Redeploy our troops and seize that machine. How could the Guardian of the Planet been reactivated while we're attacking the planet? How can we have seen this coming? They're attacking from the air, Your Highness. Use your shoulder boomerangs. I got those? Okay, L2. Do I have to, like, lock on or just fire? Oh, nope, nope, that's just fire. Shoulder boomerangs! These Vega keep on coming. It's like they had it all planned. This invasion? Yeah, they probably had it planned. They're coming back, your highness. Man, there's a lot of them. Oh, slow mo time. Okay, Duke. Thanks to you and the Guardian. But I fear the worst. Only the blackest day indeed would force us to rouse the great Grendizer from its slumber. You can see for yourself that the day I was gonna say this marriage was only a farce, a subterfuge. A ruse! Vega aren't interested in peace. They only have eyes for their precious resources. They are traitors and cowards. All of them. Don't talk nonsense, Duke. Search your heart. Rubina loves her people as much as we love Fleed. She knew nothing of this ruse. She would never have let her father do such a thing. I should never have trusted them. I should have gone with you. There's still time, Duke. I've rounded up everyone I could save. My father is with me, I'm serious. Together, we'll keep Fleed alive beyond the stars. I cannot bring myself to abandon this planet. And my family is still in the palace. 
You will have to guide your parents, your brother, and our people. All on your own, Aida. Yes, all by yourself. Nobody else can help, apparently. You can count on me, Your Highness. Prepare for takeoff, Duke. I... Farewell, my prince. Farewell, Naida. Take good care of them. Take care of what's left of Bleed. Does it look particularly aerodynamic? Okay, what is this triangle over here? Curses. That cannon is pointed oh, it's a cannon. I cannot allow it to fire. That thing is protected by a force field, Your Highness. You will have to use your anti-gravity storm to break it. Uh, the triangle in the Grinch's chest lights up to repel objects or hold them in multicolored tractor beam. Okay. Anti-gravity storm. Oh, that was easy. Vega forged. This one seems designed to take a beating, Your Highness. Use your anti gravity tool. Oh, I got him. Well done, Your Highness. One less thing for Fleet to worry about. The destructor mission complete. I didn't know these are missions. Um. Messages from that Vega embassy. Another ruse, no doubt. Let's take a closer look. It must be a ruse. Let's go investigate. Right, this is this is actually really fun so far. Oh, that's not going to close it on us. I'll have to use Grendizer's full power. We haven't yet. Blackie to all units. Fleet is finally ready. The Vegatron levels are through the roof. It's time to reveal the true nature of our facility. Start collecting. So this is the reason for their attack. To turn Fleed into a giant Vegatron farm over my dead body. Anti-gravity storm! Guys, they're punched! Got him. Excellent. Okay, well, mix up the combat. I like it. But the Vega are still hiding a few. Teacher, try to tune me into the frequency of this base, will you? Are you there, Rabina? Or is this another one of your miserable Vega tricks? Duke, my prince, it's really me. Please believe me. I have to speak to you. What could you possibly say that would torment me any further? Villains, you betrayed us. Soon, there'll be nothing left of my planet but crumbling ruins. How could you stand by and let this happen? Now, I know what it looks like, but I don't think she's involved. Ruins? I knew nothing of this. I swear it by the stars. Duke, my own father is keeping me on board his ship against my will. You must believe me, please. I know not what other follies he and his generals are capable of. You must flee, my prince. I won't let you fall with Fleet. Escape, and I'll find you. Rubina, I offered you my heart. But you stabbed me in the back. I trusted you. I won't make that mistake a second time. Duke, wait! We've done all we can, teacher. Now, we'd better return to the palace. What was this mission? Go ahead, your highness. Oh, the keep. The spacer. If we are to escape... The spacer? Grandizer will need its transport saucer. It was hidden not far from here. Thank you for being so thoughtful, teacher. Oh. But I won't abandon my planet. Let's meet at the Royal Tower. Well, there we go. This feels like first boss time. Fleet's noble architecture. Oh, we can sprint. Oh, wow, that's a Vega. sprint. But the palace won't hold up much longer. I must hurry. All this destruction. I hope our Praetorians have led my family to safety. Maria must be scared to death. I hope she's okay. Or the Vega will pay for it a hundredfold. Curse you. What do you hope to gain from death and desolation? Die 
So everything everything combos really easily too. Like this controls really well. Oh. Anyone else? Get out of my sight, monsters. Well, I counted. Oh, not enough energy. Oh. Because everything costs energy to use, which makes sense. So I got to rely on my punching a lot. And does any of this heal? No, just giant mushrooms. Oh wow! Relocating the SpaceX has proven to be more difficult than expected, my prince. Can I do that with a triangle attack? I have some fine tuning to do. Persevere, and I'll get the saucer to you as soon as possible. How dare you set foot in this palace again? That's a triangle one, man. The 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 other one was a running punch attack. That was way better. Your machines won't save you. I'll get two of these guys. Kind of got me boxed in there. Come on. I tried to roll sideways, but for some reason I went forward. Okay, this is a boss arena. The Royal Tower. My family might have found refuge there. Oh, the music. No! Oh god. <laughs> Murderer. Monster. Savage. You'll be sorry. Ooh. Okay, that did nothing. The punches do more build of I'm assuming stagger meter. Look at that stagger up, I want to see what happens. Let's get three health bars, it looks like. I'm gonna probably go down to like this beam tracks.
it's, it follows you a bit. <laughs> it's stuck? What was, what was that? Oh, did I die? Oh, did it get me in, like, against the wall and just, like, beam me to death? That was kind of cheap. They are too powerful for me. So dies my family. Bleed. Oh, damn. Oh, was I not supposed to win? Much too late. Your Highness, Grendizer cannot fall into their hands. You must survive. Use the source of Spazer. Spazer, go. Spazer, cross. Shoot out. Oh. Efficient. I always wondered one that even if I win, it would still be like, oh well, you this would still happen regardless. I didn't have it. Here we go. If anything happened to me, who would stop them from rebuilding Grendizer? From using it to swallow up other worlds. It's too late for Fleet. But I won't let any other planet suffer the same fate. I must escape as far away as possible. And the Sultan will help me. These asteroids are my cover, but I'll have to learn to dodge them. Who knows what awaits me in space? Yeah, dodge them to come at a million miles an hour. It's impossible. The Vega are after me. Speed and agility won't be oh. enough. I'll need weapons. I believe up. Let's test their effectiveness on these asteroids. Spendrill. Did uh, the asteroids take a beating though? Got him. I must get away. Grendizer must not fall into their hands. Did you think you oh, oh, oh. Me, Prince Duke? Deploy yeah. Don't let Grendizer get away, or I'll have your head. Oh, what's that green one? Was it like a healing one? There are just too many of them. I need more power. Let's try this. Yes, the green one does heal. Oh, oh Lord. <laughs> Some Star Fox level stuff. Got it. Ow. How much more is in their fleet? We've killed like a hundred of them. Oh yeah, good question. I forgot that she took off in that rocket earlier. Them. Oh, I think it's that in the top, top left there for the melt uh, shower.
Oh man. He's not the king, is this a general? I did not even put together that the shoulder blades turn into the glaive. Oh, the double harkin, sorry. Two years later. <gasps> Koji Kabuto. Oh, uh. I'm nearing Mount Fuji. Professor Genzo's facility must be nearby. His space science laboratory has reportedly seen UFOs in the area. So let's be on our guard. If a fight breaks out, I'll have nothing to defend myself with. No more giant robots. I have to get used to the terrestrial flying object. The first flying saucer ever built by humans. A wonderful machine, but a machine without weapons. Oh. So just fly, okay. Can I hit stuff? It's a UFO. So aliens are indeed on Earth. Let's try to find out what they want. Okay. UFO. If you can hear me, yeah. please tell me what planet you're from. Oh, there's more of them. So you get, speak up. This is Professor Genzo Uma from the Space Science Laboratory. Please respond to my request for identification, Koji. This is Koji aboard the prototype TFO-1. Bad timing, Professor. I'm a little busy. The radar scope is picking up several points 30 kilometers southwest of our position. Do you have a visual? I'll give it to you straight, Professor. They're UFOs, and it looks like they're coming right at me. That's a lot of UFOs for get out of the way. no military action. Like, use dodge, or I could just, like, go down. Oh no, how do I dodge that? I mean, it's a tutorial, what do you want, right? I'm supposed to be doing that, yeah. Damn, that thing flies when it dodges. Koji, are you alright? Curses. Oh. They're opening fire. Why are they attacking me? I'm not even armed. Father, those things are dangerous. Get him out of there immediately. No! Father? What on earth is going on here? These UFOs are making my son nervous. We've good reason to believe that those saucers are from... Don't have time for your family problems, Professor. I'm not even sure I can get out of this mess. NASA equipped the TFO with a mechanormizer, didn't they? The experimental repair module? Yes, if the opportunity arises, I'll try to stay on a precise trajectory. Oh, this? That should buy me some time. If you're reading me, hold your fire. I'm not your enemy. <laughs> hold your fire. Our radars are saturated with signals. This is bullet hells with no shooting back. Flying over a large river. Follow it and get closer to the laboratory. Then we can guide you out of range of enemy fire. Oh. Okay, you know what? This is interesting. Oh god. Yeah, with you, Koji. Oh, oh. No. I'm losing control. You're... Koji. Koji, answer me. Koji. Meanwhile, at the Space Science Laboratory. Oh no, we lost the signal. Try to find out how to restore it from Akira. Oh, and now we're. Now we're doing this? Wow, okay, there's... I don't like the sound of these stories about saucers. Go see Akira. Wow, I... This changes everything so much. It's fascinating. It's impossible fascinating. to re-establish contact with Koji, but I'm receiving a strange signal of unknown origin. It sounds like a radio message. Inferior beings from planet Earth. No, you are not alone. 
My name is Colonel Blackie, and I come from a dying world. My men and I have crossed an ocean of stars to reach you and deliver a message from His Excellency, King Vega. Your planet and its resources are now ours. Oh, you're just attacking. You, you arranged a whole sham marriage before. By order of General Gandalf, I demand your immediate and complete capitulation. Surrender, and you shall have the honor of being part of a new chapter in the enduring history of the Vega Empire. I, for one, welcome our new alien overlords. We are superior to you in every way, so you will obey. Or the galaxy will forget your civilization ever existed. Good heavens, this is going to get ugly. Earth is under threat. What are you going to do, Daisuke? I don't have much choice. I see. But before <laughs> you get Grandizer out, you should discuss it with Yamada. Better make sure everything is in order. So is Daisuke the, the prince, I'm assuming? Is Earth ready for Grandizer? Oh, okay, well, short and sweet. I don't like the sound. You like the sound of the saucers, huh? Okay, well, it's gonna take our awesome retro 70s clothes and just, you know, check it out. Ooh. Vega, Chrome. That reminds me. Ooh. Let's say, get four more saucer beast plans. There are 5,000 green earth points. Two saucer beasts. Ooh, okay. I wonder if those skins are different robots. That's gonna be fun. Then the time has come, hasn't it? I'm with you, Daisuke. Both the Dizer and the Spacer are ready, and so are we. All that remains is to inform your father. I'll let you speak to him. Wait, do we have our own Grandizer? What's going on here? We'll find out. I mean, don't tell me too much. I have questions. Daisuke, where are you going? You know very well, father. We are ready. It's too dangerous. We've discussed it enough. I refuse to let Earth become another flea. Okay, so yes. Suke, if those are Vega forces up there, if they know Grandizer is here, war will be inevitable. We can still prevent the worst from happening. Yeah, they seem reasonable. As long as the Vega are in this galaxy, nothing and no one will be safe. I won't let innocent people die to protect my secret. Son, I... This planet has afforded me two years of peace. Think of all it has left to offer. Let me protect it, Father. Please. Fine. Go ahead. Oh, hell yeah. Duke Lee. I love everything about this. Start Spazer. Go. Uh oh Starting off big. Are uh, not? Kind of a gun, Daisuke. What was that? A saucer beast. Looks like the Vega pulled out all the stops. This must be the monster that ambushed Koji. Let's see what it left behind. I'll uh, transform. Shoot it. Guys are go. Oh, that's a lot of missions. Oh, but so this actually is more open world. Oh, that's awesome. What's this? Uh, uh, punch? Oh, Vega documents. Mission orders that Vega officers give their troops. According to the stories, they want to conquer the Earth and get their hands on essential resources. So, we knew that. Oh, green other points. Every action helps save the planet. Do I track that somewhere? Wait, what's that flying saucer? I hit it with my... Anti -gravity storm. Oh, no. Come back here! Got it. Oh, Vega crystals are originally from the capital world of Vega. These crystals are incredibly powerful. As Vega's resources are depleted, their value increases throughout the Empire. Like Energon? Oh, uh, Vegatron armor. A uh, solidified form of Vegatron that gives Vega units unprecedented strength. It's one of the densest materials in the galaxy. 
Black Moonstone. A very light rock found in the recesses of the dark side of the moon. The Vega want to use this stone to improve their new units. So, Liquid Vegatron. A refined form of Vegatron optimal for powering Vega's production lines. More stable than its gaseous form. It nevertheless contains vast amounts of energy. That's it? Okay. Uh, let's Anti-gravity store! Wrong button. All right, let's go do one mission. That one's close. Sorry, people. Coming through. Oh, good. We can't destroy the houses. This is where Koji crashed. <laughs> Crash is the word for it. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to do one thing, though. Uh, options. Let's get the screen shake down by 50. That's more reasonable. This is definitely the crash site, Father. But his TFO is missing. Maybe the Vega hid it. Keep searching the area. If we find that saucer, we'll find Koji. Dead or alive. Okay, Professor. Our radio waves are saturated with messages from Vega's forces. But I was able to isolate one. I think it's from that Blackie character. Uh, gotta watch how you say that, man. What do you mean, losses? No earthly machine could possibly stand up to us. Find out who's responsible, and fast. Looks like you've annoyed him, Daisuke. Stay on your guard, and find Koji. A crash. Ooh, robots. Oh, where'd you come from? Oh man, this is awesome. All right, there's the purple one over there. The city's on fire. Let's go handle that. Looks like this city needs us. Let's go. It's even bigger than the others. We're doomed. Don't worry. I'm on your side. What happened here? That's what all you giant robots say. Regiments of soldiers came down from the sky to attack us. We couldn't do a thing to stop them. And even the soldiers didn't respond, even though they really close by. But you're going to help us, right? Unfortunately, I'm not sure I can maneuver around the city without getting more people hurt. However, I can find those soldiers for you. Oh, thank you. You can find our soldiers by following these coordinates. Please be quick. All right. Uh, Father has hidden Grindizer under the laboratory for two years now. Earth is about to find out about it. And just like the Vega, those soldiers might want to take it for themselves. Right, but where's their base? Come back here! Soldier All right, let's go take these things out. Yeah, I can say I figured it was gonna explode. It's required in any one of these games that has a dodge mechanic that you have an exploding enemy. It's the law. Oh, that's the base over there. So I am I am locked on that mission. Okay. Then to the base we go! After this. You know, I, I cranked down the camera shake a little bit more. I'm like, I can tell this is really gonna be a thing. What the hell is this? Oh. There hasn't been enough time to evacuate these villages. I must protect them. Oh, meditation point. What does that do, though? The fire is threatening 
to burn down this poor farm. Quick, let's make sure no one is trapped inside. Uh, you said fire and farm. Where? Oh. My crops are going up in smoke. Please do something. <laughs> sure thing. Your screw punch should do the trick, Daisuke. Excuse me? The air generated by the blades would blow out the flames. Yes. Good thinking, father. Make sure you put out those flames, Daisuke. Punch. The Vega are coming back. They started the fires by landing, so now it's over to you. I think you can stun him with the anti-gravity blast. Uh oh. Here comes the leader of their infernal squadron. I think as he attacks so slow, I get all those combos off on him. Vegatron Crystal is the purest form of energy converted by the armies of Vega, who seek to reproduce it by exhausting Earth's limited resources. Nice work. But battles like this can overtax Grandizer's systems. Yamada is on his way to check it out. Get to him as soon as you can, Daisuke. Uh, where is he? Oh. Anti-gravity store! There you are, Yamada. My father is getting you to take some real risks. This place is dangerous. Oh, don't worry. This vehicle is state of the art. I designed it after all. It's the explosion I'm proof. Not risking anything if I stay in it. And of course, I'm advancing the cause of science as well. Speaking of which, ah uh, yes, the adjustments. Well, at first glance, our repairs are holding up well. Anyway, Grendizer is in much better shape now than when the professor first discovered it on Earth. Believe me. I'm happy to hear it. This whole region is counting on me. Before you leave, you should listen to this radio message. It was the Supraletti dish on our truck that enabled me to intercept it. So that's the culprit. It has to be Grendizer. Which means that Duke Fleed, the Prince of Fleed, has found refuge on Earth. Now's our chance. Go and capture this device. So that's it. Blackie has recognized you. Yeah, I'm From trying to watch that name. won't be able to avoid things escalating. No, we can't avoid it. But we can contain it, Professor. With Grendizer's help more specifically. This is a scientific opportunity to improve Grendizer and test its capabilities in real conditions. Isn't it time to test our theories? Mr. Yamada, you're right. We Damn must Yamada. have the best chance of winning, Daisuke. Choose what you find most helpful. Oh, I gotta pick one? Oh, upgrade time. Oh! Oh, I have 500, uh, points? So we got... Okay, I can't buy anything yet. Uh, Grand Energy strikes with its axe. Attack can be charged. Uh, Nectar deals more damage after a skill. Eh. Knocks down unarmed enemies. The boomerang's knocked down enemies. That could be useful. Briefly, uh, enemies are mobilized for a longer time. That could be very useful. Under four is forearm. Melee attack. Melee attacks after a skill. Uh, you know what? I'm going to just say they're immobilized longer. That seems good. Oh, wow. There's multiple areas in here, too? Those were green at parts. So I, I, so I got one of 500. Excellent choice. If you need any more upgrades, Daisuke, come back to the laboratory or to this vehicle. I'll never be far away. Anyway, the first priority is to find this pilot. They're working on it. Me. I'll find Dead or alive. Ah, uh, here's the base.
The soldier like, oh crap. Major Otter. May I ask who I'm dealing with? Where I come from, I'm known as Grindizer. But I don't have time for introductions now. Uh, Koji wants us to focus on the city. Your fellow citizens need you, Major Ota. An entire city is in danger. Right. We'll handle that. But we're running out of fire support. All you have to do is follow my orders. With all due respect, Major, we have a common enemy. But Grindizer doesn't take orders from anyone. Not even me. Your men can do the job. I understand your distrust. As a token of my goodwill, I can share with you that we received a distress signal from a certain terrestrial flying object. A friend of yours, perhaps? He can't be far away. I'll try to find the TFO. But I won't forget your help, Major. Thank you, sir. And away he goes! Alright, you know, guys, that's going to do it for this episode of Grandizer. If you guys want to keep going, let me know. But I am having an absolute fun time playing this. Like, a quasi-open world, old-school mech, you know, action, side-scrolling shooter, like, top-down shooter slash, like, Star Fox style. Like, this, like, with all different places, like, this is actually better than I thought it was going to be. This is really fun. So if you want to keep going, let me know. But until next time, thanks again for watching, and I'll see you guys later.